Real mystery unfolding tonight after what happened inside this house in Wayne. Yeah, homicide investigators spent hours trying to figure out what led to the death of a person. Let's bring in Coco McAboy. Uh, so far, police staying pretty quiet about it, though, Coco. That's right, Devin and Kimberly. Police aren't saying much at this time. All we know is a person was shot and killed inside of this home, but police were out here for more than 10 hours investigating. They actually just cleared the scene about an hour ago, and that has neighbors like Kathy Esser on edge. So it's it's hard just to see it. It really is sad. Kathy Esser lives just a few doors down from where the homicide took place this morning in the 35,000 block of John R. Police knocked on the door. We heard a knock at 720 and I said, who is it? And I hear state police. So of course I'm a little stunned. Police say they were called to the scene on a report that a person was shot, but when they arrived, they found a person dead inside the home. I was stunned because this is such a quiet neighborhood. Police searched a vehicle parked outside of the house and have been collecting evidence at the scene for hours. All very scary for neighbors who are left wondering what really happened and why. Absolutely stunned that somebody was murdered and it's so sad. To find out that somebody died a couple doors from you. Obviously a scary situation and anyone with information is asked to call the Wayne Police Department. Reporting live this evening, I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4. Well, I know police aren't obviously saying much. Are they telling us whether there are any suspects yet? Right now, police are saying that there are no suspects right now, but at the same time, they're also saying that there's no threat to the public. So again, a lot of neighbors concerned. So we're expecting police to release more information soon. Yeah. All right, Coco.